a lot of these companies are not happy with this show. And so every single day I get calls and they are negative calls and there are calls telling me to shut down the channel. There are calls telling me that, you know, um, that because I interviewed so-and-so, it's hurt their business. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. Your information is not free anymore because you have some type of membership. The mother trucker getting threats from these companies to shut his channel down. Close that fucker down. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. I've been getting emails uh, basically saying that, you know, you know, Alex, uh, your information is not free anymore because you have some type of membership program. You know, why did I make a membership join button? The, the truth is so many trucking interviews. We've had a lot of interviews where uh, truck drivers have stated very uh, strong words that have hurt companies. Uh, that have shut down companies and a lot of these companies are not happy with this show. I get calls and they are negative calls and there are calls telling me to shut down the channel. There are calls telling me that, you know, um, that because I interviewed so-and-so it's hurt their business. I'm, I'm at the point where it's hard to pick up the phone because I don't know if this person is going to be aggressive or not towards me or the channel. And so I find myself not picking up the phone anymore. They don't have anything positive that they want to say to me. The reason why I, I am even doing that membership, I'll keep it honest. I would like to follow and support your YouTube channel as well. Really, it's just a way to keep the nonsense away. It, if you really want to talk to me, that's what the membership's about. Just weeding out the bad. All right. So, you know, hopefully you guys understand. I'm sorry if you're a trucking company that's scamming drivers, but if you are, then, hey, if a driver wants to put you on blast, that's on them. Mother truckers, I hope you guys understand, but that's pretty much what that membership is for. All right, guys, you heard it for yourself. A lot of you guys have reached out to me via email, and y'all sent me this particular link, but I'm going to tell you guys from the beginning, all right? So shout out to my man's man, D Nitty, as always. You know, he sent me good stuff like this. But shout out to um, On The Road Trucker. Um, and shout out to uh, B-Way. B-Way, you know what I'm saying? They all sent me the link to this video. All right. So let me tell you, I already seen the video. I, I already watched it. I already comprehended it. And, you know, I, I pretty much said to myself that, hmm, you know, it's, it's a good, I mean, it's a good idea, you know, it's always a good idea to make more money. What? M more money is not a good idea, you know, but uh, uh, you guys, you know, kind of like want my reaction to this. And to be totally honest with you, I don't think it's a bad idea. I mean, it is what it is. I mean, the young man has over 300K subscribers, 300K. So why not do a, a join, a membership? I know what you guys want me to do. I'm not gonna do it, all right? I mean, I even commented it on the video. I I said it's funny because I, you know, I have drivers that comes on the platform and express their discomfort with previous companies all the time. I mean, hell, just look at just 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 hashtag super eagle. <laughs> okay. And you'll see a lot of drivers showing their discomfort about Super Eagle, you know. And now I'm I'm getting a lot of calls from drivers that's 
that's talking about VL trucking again. Like VL trucking is 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 coming back to the forefront. As far as as threats came, it it, it pretty much came from the Make the Call series. But of course, you know, I I get some recruiters that will call me back and they be like, oh. I didn't mean to say that, or I didn't want that information out there or whatever the case, but that's about it. That's, that's the extent of it. As far as companies, uh, trucking answers had a cease and desist order levied against him because he did a, he did a crap call or crap company of the week. And I think it was either CR England or CR ST. It was one of those two, but I'll, I'll, I'll put it up. The crap company are lawyers. Yep, we knew this day would come, so let's talk about it. One company got all butthurt about their information that they post on their website publicly for every computer in the world to see. And so they sent a lawyer over and said, look, we're really mad that you publicized information that we publicize. We don't like that. So you got to stop it or we're gonna get really, really mad and do other mad things. And then they added a bunch of lawyer words in there. So just paper you to death because they're all butthurt about the information that they put out being actually put out publicly. They don't like it, so. But he had a he had an actual company, you know, their lawyers actually called him or emailed him and said, yo, you know, we need you, you know, we need you to take that video down. But that's about the only thing that I heard as far as companies threatening YouTubers to, to shut their channel down because now that's about it. You know, that you, the individual is talking about that company, but when other people come on your platform and talk about their experience, it's their experience when they talk about, you know, said companies. So I, I, man, I, I'm, I'm sorry that's happening to him. I'm, I really is, I'm, I'm, I'm honestly, but as far as him doing a joint, I don't, I, I, I don't have no, I, I, I don't have no comments about that. I, I don't, why not? You're a very popular trucking channel that everybody just about in the world watches okay everybody everybody likes them you know what i'm saying what's what's not to like about him you know what's what's not to like about him i mean he 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 presents truckers with with trucking information he's the only he's the only truck driver of uh, trucking youtuber that does that that does that you tell me any other channels that provides as much trucking information that he provides right right or wrong whether you agree with him or disagree with him you know what i'm saying he, he he's the only one that's literally providing uh trucking information out here so why not do a join now, now the reason for it i mean it, it kind of sounds like what another youtuber did you know what i'm saying it kind of sounds like that in a way you know but hey look 4.99 to join the channel you get exclusive content and you get exclusionality to him you know he, he don't want to give out his phone number now as far as phone number goes, you know, I don't know if it was his personal phone number or not, but if it was, yeah, don't, don't give out your personal phone number. I mean, there's ways to get business phone numbers, you know, Google voice, text now, uh, 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 Google chat or whatever. You don't give nobody your, your phone number, bruh. <laughs> not, not your main number. You don't see the thing is. You don't give everybody like accessibility to you, not by your phone number, not by your personal phone number, not by your personal, not by your personal number, not by your personal email 
and definitely not by your personal Facebook. Now, everybody knows you as the as the mother trucker, just like everybody knows me as lockout man. So in order to get, you know, in order to follow me or get a hold of me or something like that, you got to either go to you got to go to IG and reach out to me that way. Or you just have to leave a comment in the comment session. And if I see it, then I'll respond to it. Or that's it. My text number is in the is it's in the uh, description. But that's about it. That's about it. That's how you're gonna. That's the only way you're gonna get a hold of me. It's like, it's it's like I gotta I gotta vet you first before I actually talk to you in voice. And when I talk to you in voice, nine times out of ten is gonna be on the podcast. If not on the podcast, just know that the conversation is gonna be recorded. You know, so that'll work out both ways. So if I do get threats. Or anything like that, I will have it recorded and then I can, you know, properly handle that. So again, I mean, there's nothing to to comment about his join. I don't have a problem with that. I don't have a problem with that. He got over three, he got over 300 k subscribers. In my opinion, if that's what y'all really want. I just think that it was inevitable that it didn't happen even sooner. You know, you figure, you figure you got 300 K subscribers. Hell, you get about 10 doubt. You get about 10 K. Uh, you get about 10 K of them to join the channel. You get 10 K to join the channel. That's about 50 K right there. Stra in your bro why not why not i mean that's that's what it is but we're going to jump into some of these comments because whoo these comments boy man this comments is is ruthless damn good coffee and hot this commenter says i don't mind paying for information nothing is free these days the bigger your channel gets the more it will be targeted by shady people. You need to have a legal team in place if you don't already. I agree. That's why everybody that comes on the channel that talks to me signs a podcast release. Everybody. I, I, I either test it to them or I email it and they have to sign off on it. That's a good way to protect yourself. Uh, this commenter says, sorry to hear that, bro that jealous people yes sir yes sir this commenter says who cares how these big companies feel they need to do right by i mean do right and take care of the drivers hands down of course my guy i mean these companies need to stop playing with these drivers man they just do they just do stop playing with the drivers and pay us what, what we do to work for you this commenter says hey why don't you donate your 499 to cancer research or something good and then see what happens and then no one can be saying nothing i mean that's up to him whether or not he want to donate the, the 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 money that's coming in to you know whatever his charity is you know man this commenter right here says keep it honest you have never posted anything to help trucker you're not a trucker you're a fake oh my god no he was a truck driver bruh he he was a truck driver i mean he's 100 as far as being a truck driver i mean the way he got everything set up now he don't need to drive you know you don't need to drive but he was a truck driver. He came back. Oh, same commenter came back. Bro, you. Oh, you got time. That's demon time right here, bro. He says it's finally coming out that this dumb spread lies and he's too stupid to even comprehend simple things 
that's happening in the industry. He supports stupid. No, this is more lies. He has not caused any trucking companies to lose business. He has not caused any companies to shut down. He's having problems because I spread the word that he's spreading lies and we all called him out on it. Lies. Wake up. He only posts stupid to get content to get money from YouTube. We have told YouTube that he needs to be demonetized and they are taking his money away. He wants money for spreading lies. What lies are you talking about though? That's what I need to know. I, I need to understand that because what lies is he talking about? Um, lies like that super ego situation, that whole super ego debacle. I don't think that was, I don't think that was lies that he was spreading. I, I, I honestly think that he was, I mean, I honestly think that something has transpired for him to come out and do that particular video. I don't know whether it was money or, or whatever. Is that what you're talking about? Because as far as lies go, I mean, brother man, brother man does the, you know, does the reaction to videos off of TikTok. Same thing that I do, you know, react to trucking videos off of TikTok or whatever. He puts his own spin on it, just like I put my spin on it. But as far as, as far as lies, I don't know. I mean, everything that he's, that he spit about the trucking industry, everything from the FMCSA to, to the industry as a whole, I don't, I, I don't, I, at least I don't think there was lies. I mean, they was fact checked. I mean, he, he talked about the information from, from credible sources. And this last commenter says, let me take over the channel. I'll expose these bad companies even more. Keep doing what you're doing, brother. We appreciate it. And we got your back. Look, you know, I, I've been knowing Alex. <laughs> I, I've been knowing Alex for a good minute. All right. I mean, again, like I said before, we, we collaborated uh, in the past. I, I don't see this man going out the way to like lie and the information that he does give the truckers are valid, are valid. Okay. I mean, as far as him doing the join, it was, to me, it was inevitable. It was inevitable. And I know that you guys will be like, Oh, well, you know, paying for information, yada, 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 get that out of here because y'all, y'all, y'all pay, y'all pay YouTubers. But in any case, in any case, you guys is still paying YouTubers out there money, you know, for, for whatever information that they're given, given whether it's good or bad, y'all still pay them, you know? So why do you guys get upset when the mother trucker starts to join uh, a join campaign? People is gonna people is gonna pay who they feel like paying, bro. Whether the information is good or bad, they 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 gonna pay regardless because they like the guy. They like their favorite YouTuber. That's why they give them money. It doesn't matter whether that YouTuber, I mean, that YouTuber ain't trucking no more or that YouTuber is doing regional or that YouTuber is doing OnlyFans. If you like them, if you like them a lot and you support them, then you're going to pay. I know a lot of you guys not going to do that and I understand and that's cool, but you know, others going to. So again, I, you know, kind of, I, I know this is kind of long and I didn't want it to be that damn long, but you know, I at least wanted to get some of my points out, but I mean, 
you know, in order to get, in order, you know, his reasoning and his reasoning to, to, to start a joint membership for his channel. I, I understand it's a good, it's, it's a, it's a good method because a lot of, a lot of bigger YouTubers hide behind Patreon, you know, in order to get, in order to get to them directly, you got to pay like 25, 30, 35 or whatever amount of money that you got to pay to them. You know, that's it. That, that's my thoughts. Drivers, what's your thoughts? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. Big G's got it locked. Boy. Won't you let me out?